What's going on legends? We are working on this VY today and we also have a VUSS we're going to be working on. This one's getting the brakes replaced and the VUSS is getting guard rolling. Um, yeah, and we'll see what else happens. I've tried, I tried to book in not a lot of work today because I really want to put out a bunch of reels this weekend, seeing as it's a long weekend. Um, and I've done none of that yet. So uh, yeah, I'm hoping to smash out these jobs and then jump on the computer and then punch out a bunch of reels. So yeah, anyway, let's get into it. On a Saturday, sneaking out of the door like you know the way A thousand times before, back at light of day I trail the smoke in your show, hope to go where it goes I can tell which is silent Oh, you figured it out
Alt Legends, we're now onto this SAR SS Ute, what well, looks like a Malu Ute from here, but it is an SS Ute. And uh, we're going to be rolling the guards on this today. The owner did buy a guard roller and have a crack at doing it himself, but then he rang me in, in distress and uh, needed me to save him. So I've A, bought the guard roller off him, and B, I'm going to roll his guards and um, yeah, fix it up. It, I might make it look easy in the videos by accident, but rolling guards is technical if you don't know what you're doing. Um, I did have a guy comment on one of my videos the other day saying it was an easy job. Um, I don't really agree with that because I've seen so many bad jobs. So obviously, like I find it easy because I've done thousands of them, but if you've never done it, or if you've only done a couple, you're probably not gonna know what you're doing and you're probably gonna make a mistake. So yeah, the only issue we might have with this car, especially with the side that he's scratched, is that it's had a fresh paint job. Um, it's really better. It's so much better to roll your guards before you get your car painted. Um, because you can go as hard as you want. You don't need to worry about faking any paint or whatever because you're gonna paint the car anyway. The only problem with painting a car, the, the, having a car that's been painted and working with the panels isn't terrible, but it depends on how they've prepped it before they painted it. So most painters will obviously sand the whole car, but not many people scuff or sand inside the guard lock in the, where the lip is. And so when they blow the paint in there, it doesn't stick properly. So when you roll the guard, it just literally flakes off. So that can be an issue with rolling the guards with a car that's been painted, um, is bad prep. But anyway, let's get into it. So the guy with this ute said to me, um, while it's on the hoist, just a quick little job for you. There is a sway bar bolt missing, and I assumed that he meant from one of the link pins, but no. It's missing from that bad boy. So it's actually fully popped the sway bar out and the bracket and everything. So yeah, it's popped the bracket out and everything. So I'm hoping that it's not missing because someone cross-threaded the bolt and then they just left it in there and it's ripped itself out um, because otherwise it's a bigger job than just putting a bolt in. But I'll disconnect the sway bar links now um, and then, yeah, we'll try and get a bolt in there. I will take this, if I can, I might actually take the, might drop the diff down, take the sway bar links off and then take the sway bar out and then get a bolt and put it in there and just check that the hole's good. Um, and then I'll put it all back together because I'm just thinking rather than trying to get a hand up there and jam it in and then find out it's cross-threaded I might be able to fix it Without too much trouble if I drop the cradle down just at the back So yeah, we'll um, we'll do that now and then And we'll see how we go Yeah, so as you can see, where he had a crack at uh, rolling the guards and slipped and scratched the paint there. Um, not good. I did notice that the inside is actually scrubbing on one side. The other side's fine. So, quite weird. But we'll give that a bit of a belt. It looks like the actual tub's been pushed in. Um, 
but like not the back like the bottom bit but yeah the top part i reckon i'll be able to get it so it doesn't scrub but yeah here we go we are into it heck all those little center cap things that i have to take off a little bit of a trick you gotta because you take the direct the nut off and then the the caps are sitting in there there's no actually like thing to push it out but you just give it like a little tap and it pops it and enough that you can get your fingers behind and take it out you definitely set me up with that bolt though ended up having a, it was hard to film so i don't know what i really got much of it but um i had to tap the bolt hole out and put a new bolt in there so yeah whether he did that or i reckon whoever did whoever installed the sway bar um must have stuffed it up and maybe they thought it was tight because it cross threaded it so they probably thought the bolt was in there done up um and then it's ripped out so but yeah i've tapped it out and put a bolt all the way in it's nice and firm and done up and should be all good now so that's one problem solved but that took me a while um i reckon that at least took me an hour to fix that it's a bit of a bit of a bit of a stuff around but that's all right and the uh, quick job it's always when the customer says oh yeah just got a little quick job for you it's never quick <sighs> but anyway let's get into rolling these guards
All right, guys, so that's it. That's done. I've done the uh, SS Ute and the other car, whatever it was, the VY, has been done. That bolt sort of caught me off. Um, so it's taken me a little bit longer than I thought to get my day finished, but yeah, I've got all the jobs done. I've just got to jump on the computer now. I've got a bunch of videos to edit, so yeah, I was kind of looking forward to chilling out tonight, but I think I'm going to have to stay here at work and just get through some content. Um, yeah, so I can get something out this weekend. Yeah, I appreciate you guys watching the video, and if you guys need work done to your car, hit me up. Wheel Clearance Solutions and Suspension Upgrades is my thing. Alright guys, see you on the next one.